Welcome back to the Opedia Tutorials. Today I'm gonna teach how to do bunny from Five Nights at Freddy's. If you are new to this channel, be sure to like, subscribe, and comment below. I'm gonna draw on my Wacom tablet, but you can follow my tutorials with any other media that you have, whether it's pencil color, Sharpie, or crayon. Now, first of all, I'm gonna draw the top of his head with an arch curve line across. Turn it downwards and flare it slightly out on both sides of the head. And on his cheek, diagonal turn outwards, semi could turn downwards, semi could turn to the middle of his face, and mirror that same set of line on the right side of his face right there. In the middle of his face, I'm going to draw his nose with an oval shape. And inside of that, a small circle on the right corner. I'm going to fill in the nose with black color. Now at the side of the nose, curve line outwards. Same as you could turn downwards. Same as you could turn to the right. Curve line across to the right and mirror that same shape on the right side of his face. Below his nose, I'm going to draw a line downwards at that corner. And for his eye, I'm going to draw a curve line upwards above his nose, off center to the left. Curve line across to the left, same as a turn downwards at the outer corner of the eye. Same as a turn back to the middle and to his nose. Inside of that, I'm going to draw a curve line across that corner and from the ending point on both sides curve line downwards same as you could turn across to the other side same as you could turn back upwards inside of that I'm gonna draw a circular shape in the middle point for his pupil and inside of that a black dot in the middle point copy the whole eye shape on the right side Now for his ear, I'm going to draw a U curve line on the top left corner of his head right there. Turn it diagonally upwards on the left corner. And I'm going to do the same thing on the right side. Same as a turn to the left. At that ending point, I'm going to draw a curve line up. Same as a turn to the left. Turn it diagonally down to the left. Same as a turn downwards and turn it back to the right same as you could turn upwards at that corner inside of that shape at the lower point I'm going to draw a curve line across right there and below that curve line to the right same as you could turn diagonally to the lowest point of the ear in between the ear and the head I'm going to draw two lines downwards at that point and I'm going to mirror the whole ear shape on the right side of his head. Below his head, I'm going to draw his lower jaw with curve line downwards on the left corner. Turn it diagonally in to the right same as could turn across to the right on his chin mirror the same shape of the jaw on the right side right here inside of that shape below the mouth on the left corner I'm gonna draw a diagonal line across to the right slightly downwards same as could turn and a line across same as could turn back diagonally upwards on the right side of the mouth above that line Above that line, I'm going to draw in the middle point an arch curve line for the upper part of the teeth, a line downwards on both ending points at the side. Copy that same set of line across to the side of his mouth.
below his head, I'm gonna draw a ribbon and in the middle point, I'm gonna draw a small rectangular shape from the side of that rectangular shape at the upper corner diagonal curve line out to the left and upwards semi turn downwards curl it inwards to the right sharp turn back out mirror the same shape from the top at this lower point mirror the whole thing on the right side from the side of the ribbon I'm gonna draw a curve line out same as a turn downwards flare it back outwards with a curve line all the way to the side of his waist and mirror that same set of curve line on the right side and from the ending point on the left I'm gonna draw a curve line across to the right same as a turn downwards curve line across turn it back upwards on the right corner curve line across to the right above that line on the left corner I'm gonna draw a curve line up similar to the line at the outer corner curve line to the side of his ribbon at the upper corner I'm gonna do the same thing on the right side below his waist I'm gonna draw a curve line to the middle curve line downwards from the ending point at the side curve line across to the right semi turn diagonally downwards curve line across to the right and I'm gonna mirror the whole thing on the right side below the hips I'm gonna draw his upper leg with diagonal curve line from the outer corner to the middle and slightly downwards semi good turn downwards on both sides with curve line and slightly inwards towards his knee curve line across above his knee on his knee I'm gonna draw an arch curve line across below that semi good turn downwards on both sides curve it inwards below the knee curve line across for the lowest point of the knee right there and from the side of that curve line downwards on both the left and right flare it out and turn it back inwards like that curve line across on his ankle point below that in the middle point I'm going to draw a small rectangular shape at that corner at the side of that rectangular shape curve line diagonally out on the left corner semi good turn downwards on the right corner diagonal curve line out and downwards and at that ending point an arch curve line across to the right turn it downwards curve line across to the left repeat that same shape of the toes across to the left side and another one at that corner I'm gonna copy the whole leg shape on the left side Now for your shoulder, I'm going to draw an arch curve line out to the left right there. Curve line across to the right. Below that, I'm going to draw a circular shape at that point. Below that circular shape from the outer corner, a line across to the right and slightly downwards. From the ending point at the outer corner, curve line diagonally down and to the left. Curve line across to the right, slightly downwards. 
diagonal curve line back upwards to the right. Below, below that, from the inner corner, a line outwards to the left and curve line downwards on both ending points at the side. Curve line across at the ending point below. Below that, on his wrist, I'm going to draw an arch curve line. Turn it downwards at the inner corner on the right. Diagonal turn out to the right. U curve line to the left. Turn it diagonally up. And below the thumb, a line downwards. Turn it diagonally to the right. U curve line to the left. Turn it diagonally up at the outer corner. Copy the same shape of the fingers across to the left at that corner. Turn it upwards to his wrist at the outer corner. Mirror the whole arm's shape on the right side. And that's all for our tutorial today. I hope you enjoy it and find my lessons helpful. Be sure to like and subscribe to this channel. Also, feel free to drop your requests, suggestions, or any other comments in the comment section below. See you next time.